We begin this hour with the latest developments on the future of Rhode Island's tallest building. The so-called Superman building, which has been home to Bank of America, will officially close later today. Eyewitness News reporter Andrew Adamson has more on what's next for this Providence landmark. Well, Patrick, way off the dist in the distance behind me, you can kind of see back there that iconic Superman building. It's lighting up the early morning sky right now, but it remains to be seen how long that will happen before. As you said, the tallest building in Rhode Island will lock its doors at 2 p.m. today. Bank of America had been operating inside, but their lease on the superstructure expires at the end of this month. It's unknown what the future holds, but one option may be luxury apartments. That's according to the Massachusetts-based owner, High Rock development. They're hoping to get tax credits to help with the project, but that would require the state assembly to revive a tax credit program which ended in 2008. And since Bank of America currently pays for the lighting, when that lease does expire, the lighting could go dark. We're going to keep you posted on this developing situation. For now, though, live with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Andrew Adamson, Eyewitness News.